And you know another thing, we as sane people across the globe need to look into this shit. All countries, you need to look into this shit. If you're against communism, China, gang stalking, you know, all of that shit, all of this you're like uh you're you're gonna be like, well, just let the let, let's see if that dude cheated. The 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 white guy, the cop. You're like, what is that? Because his wife immediately left. You could say, remember I said they always pick ch- subjects that are just so grievous. If you agree, uh, if you ask, even if you say something logical, let's wait and see if, or let's see the facts. Remember, remember a couple of years ago, it was uh, Me Too and, and women getting raped and, it, it, and they tried, they, it was a right. How come there, matter of fact, how come there's no more? I, I thought men were so bad. Damn, I'm going off again. I thought men were so bad, especially black men, that they, that, that. They needed a whole moment. Remember, there was a uh, this case about this one chick who went to the club with no panties on and uh, one of them body skirts about the size, you know, with my shirt, but you know, it's tight. And, and supposedly she got raped, and and guys were just so bad and out of control. And everybody, even women, like, no, who would do that? Who would rape? You know, you can see the girl clearly. You know, basically, she's a slut, and they're trying to railroad this guy. And yeah, some of us were, you know, like, well, no sympathy. That's pretty dumb. Not because, oh, you're cheating or because you nasty, you fucked her in the club with no rubber. Because actually, yeah, most guys wouldn't do that. That's That was why that whole thing fell apart. Is like, again, they're not human. They don't understand. Or either that one, it was concocted by, in the, in the heads of a woman who, you know, her boyfriend's always at the club. No real man gonna do that. No, no, it's embarrassing from when you was a teenager. Because we don't get excited if we're at the club, and you see, you hear, oh, that girl was out in the parking lot sucking dick. Da, da, da. That doesn't make you excited. That makes you leave her alone. Like no, I'm talking about when you're 18. You don't be like, oh yeah, I gotta get some of that. And that's why, and they, when they tried to come with that narrative, oh, I, uh, I hate the word narrative. Come with the story about uh, cause cause it's, one, it's, it's some of that new shit, that bullshit. They tried to make up the story that uh, I'm talking about the word narrative. That 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 that's the bullshit. But also the story they tried to make up was that he was just some men are just so desperate and da 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 da. And, and she, you know, and she didn't deserve to be raped because just cause she didn't have no. They didn't understand. They missed the point. The whole points. Is even the, the the ratchet ass thuggest ass nigga ain't finna do it because that's embarrassing. Nigga, you fucked that old nigga. She was just in the parking lot se- serving up two other dudes. You got sloppy seconds and thirds. It doesn't matter. She gave it to you for free. Da 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 da. You stupid nigga. That's disgusting. When nobody be in the club grinding up on her. Anyway, anyway, I, my point is, they just, again, it's the same shit. It's like they don't understand real people. Real people ain't going to do that. And they think this is stuff that people like is in their head. The nerds is that they're white supremacists. They're thinking of doing all this shit, standing on black people's necks, just like the women. That dudes are just out there cheating and fucking women in clubs. And it's like, no, ain't nobody going to do that. You know, because supposedly she had been with other dudes, so it was like, no. Like two men or ten men or even an hour before. You're not going to be like, yeah, I got to get some of that. And then, like I said, these idiots, they're so clueless. They're, oh, you're being disrespectful. How is that disrespectful? You're being disrespectful by lying on us. That is a lie, a straight-up lie that is bearing false witness. You're not gonna make it into heaven because you're a liar. You can hold your, you can try to walk off, and you're not gonna. Your preacher can't save you. Your preacher can't go against the Bible. He can try to make you feel better while you repent for bearing false witness on someone. That's all he could do. He could try to soothe you. He could put some salve on your eyes. That's all he can do. But you fucked up. You lied. You lied. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody gonna be like, oh, I just got to get that. 
in the middle of a club. Even if the dudes, you don't even know that the rest of the dudes, that's just embarrassing. You're going to feel some, you know, you're going to feel that embarrassment, that heat that you would, you wouldn't even want to dance with her. Cause she was just out in the out in the parking lot or in the fucking that they, they said you know which is true what they're saying is true we are that's what that goes back to I always say we do agree with that she doesn't nobody says she should be raped that's my point nobody would nobody would be that desperate not no real nigga and so when you saw the dope dad choose you like you don't even know that guy it's like bro sorry I I, I mean according to y'all and y'all the ones who 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 would be the main one no the women. And it's like, no, we're men. We can't do that. You can't get, you can't hang that dude out to dry like that. And all the ones swear that nigga up and down, you know, it's the shit. And y'all could try to lie. No, nobody. No, bitch. Y'all stupid. And like I said, we're not going to be like, you know, first of all, you would, you, would, you would feel the heat just from dancing with her. You wouldn't even want to dance with her. Like, man, I ain't finna be dancing with this hoe. You know what I'm saying? All in front of all hugged up and shit. Nigga, you crazy as fuck. So that's how we know. Y'all like, well, da, 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 da. Anyway, anyway. I was really on something else. You could be mad. See what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. That's why y'all not gonna make it. I don't care what y'all think of me. And it's not my opinions. These are facts. History. School books, history books, fairy tales all say the same thing. There's no way you're going to win with this night. You could be mad. You can you could be a woman and be mm-hmm, mm-hmm. read the story of Jezebel and why she got eaten eaten by dogs. So you can keep on walking, with, you know, getting mad. You're the one came at me. I wouldn't be talking about you if you didn't come at me, Jezebel. What part you don't understand? Leave us the fuck alone. You, whoever you mad at, be mad at him. See what I'm saying? Just just cause you it, it looking indignant and and, and and walking off that that what the fuck smack it? You know what I'm saying? Look walking off looking uh, indignant like somebody insulted you. That doesn't mean you're right. That's not the law. That's not even God's law. You're not going to get away with it. He knows what you did. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, again, oh, I know what I started off with this whole thing was about. You got to see if that dude cheated on his wife. You know, because remember, every people pointing out she thought she was all that. She's a beauty queen. You're like, what is that? Do-? Hey, she might have just sacrificed that dude. She felt, again, you see how that female, that, that she walked off and like, because hmm, I'm talking shit. I'm protected. I'm really protected. Y'all ain't protected. Y'all not Christians. Y'all are fucking heathens. You're not protected. Devil can't protect you. So, and I, obviously, uh, the dude, uh, the cop, he wasn't protected. And it has nothing to do with race, him marrying uh, whatever she is, Filipino, Chinese, whatever. You know, but think about it. She got a little, little, little chip on her shoulder. Ego. She's a, you know, been in kind of beauty pageants. Even if it was a local beauty pageant, it could be just her church. But she won. She beat all the rest of the people out for that year. And he might have did something that she deems irredeemable. And that, remember, they look up gang stalking, the people they put on the program. And remember, they got stuff and techniques to make people do things. I'm not trying to, I'm saying, if you care about yourself and your freedom, and if you hear my words, and you're, 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 I don't care who you are, you got the authority to investigate this shit somehow. And I ain't even talking about the regular investigation. Y'all need to really get on the, the fuck, y'all rhinos, y'all Democrats, y'all Republicans only in name. Y'all need to start really looking into or at least say something at least say something y'all keep saying y'all got evidence uh giuliani and trump y'all y'all need to really do something man if y'all letting this shit happen if y'all really know about this program and you see the whole scam uh the scandemic and the scam impeachment Y'all really need to do something, do something, man. And you, y'all let this shit blindside y'all. Y'all see, they were spying on y'all just like they spy on us, the FBI. That's how they they were spying on Trump. The FBI was spying on you. 
Come on, you don't don't tell me. Y'all don't see the violations of all our rights. And it's more than just spying. They spy on you to use it against you to, to do their little thing, like the little bitch that got out the car right there. That's how they spy on you. And they, they all this manipulation. It's 2020. You can't even act like they don't have, you know, ways to manipulate you with, with microwaves and, or just waves. You know what I'm saying? Brain stimulus. Hit a certain cortex of the brain, you know, make your arm jump. You know how they got, you know, shit like that or just anything. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I ain't trying to get dude off. I'm talking about us, the rest of us. You know, all of us. And you got that, them little lame ass, like that, 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 that fucking, that nigga, the mayor, you know, or whatever city he is, he up there. You know, we got a, our, we got a, uh, <laughs> our inhumanity. That, 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 he's a fucking witch. He's a witch doctor. He's a war, uh, not a warlord. He's a fucking punk. He's a witch doctor, a warlock. That's not a warlord. He's a warlock. He's a bitch ass nigga. He wouldn't have made it in the arena. He wouldn't have made it. He got to goddamn use women and children to sacrifice them to win. He has to sacrifice women and children and men. Well, the men getting sacrificed, you know, basically doing stupid shit because they're under their control because they can't, you know, they don't, they're not saved. They're not protected. But the women, you know, he got to use witches and, and sacrifice children and sacrifice folks, sacrifice men and, and you know, whatever. He got to do shit like that. He's not a fucking warlord. He's a fucking punk bitch. Trust me. And your little words is really flying over everybody's head. Not because we're slow, but because it's, everybody see the, the shit spewing out your mouth. Just like Jesus said, he going to spew you out his mouth. You fucking goddamn devil. You know what I'm saying? That nigga is, the, is another one. All them coming forward. You know what I'm saying? We got y'all can drive by with y'all little motherfucking bitch ass nigga just like right now. And you can drive by. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Like I said, they ain't no warlords or no warriors. They're fucking cowards. They're not warriors. They're fucking cowards. That's why they just drive. I don't know what that was supposed to mean. Nigga, if I drive by, trust me, I'ma stop. If I'm driving by your fucking crib and shit, and it's a reason we driving by your crib, and I see you out there, even on the second floor, I'm stopping. If that's the case, if it's to the point where I am I feel like we got to drive through and make a point to see and you see us driving, but we ain't driving through and just got down uh, keeping going. I'm finna, hey, stop the car, nigga, put it in park. I'm finna get out. You know what I'm saying? I ain't finna do no whole shit like that. That nigga ain't no warrior or no warlord. He's a fucking bitch. All these niggas is bitches. Straight up. They don't want none. Trust me, we got this in the bag. I guarantee this shit is in the fucking bag. These some whole ass niggas. All these men who, so-called men who identify with liberals and Democrats. <laughs> we got them. These fucking pieces of shit. They bitches.